using data across the board, you know, for evidence-based um, learning, you know, that's where we're going and Pat is a real great resource to, to enable us to do that. Um, we've been able to go to the results there, look at the bands, um, see where the kids are and that's been able to inform our teaching. We've also been able to look at the PAT far more successfully than we did 14 or two yeah, years ago. That's right, yeah. And it is a great resource. As so We've been able, as well, we're always using NAPLAN, but it's another angle that we can um, look at evidence from. Um, NAPLAN has its own way of doing it and PAT but almost reinforces that um, and uh, as I say, by using the bands, not only do we get um, some diagnostic information, but then we can get formative stuff so we can go and create stuff as well um, from the data that we've collected. So it, we've got the resource stuff going on as well. And, and then at the end, um, we get our summative as well. So when you go back and do it on the second time, you can see the improvement. Mm. And that's a chance for us then to celebrate that, um, that we've actually done something really well. And that symmetry was a really good example of that, wasn't it? Yes, it was. Yeah, but, yeah sorry, yeah. From the, from the first test to the yeah, second, second test, test, Yeah. I mean, as a school, we saw improvement in every single student. Yeah. So to me, that's a, a positive. Real positive from it, yeah. yeah. And that's helping us now to see the importance of using data. We actually, we may have overlooked symmetry and just, just left it, but mm. by that actually picked it out. We've done it across the board. And so Pat's been really helpful in doing that. So now it gives us more confidence to say, right, we can look at a few more areas now and then see if we can do, you know, achieve the same results.